ammonia on Colombo test zero. Nitrite results on the Colombo test. I'm at zero. Nitrate test. I'm going to be between 30 and 60. Tap water, 20 milligram per liter. So how can I address that problem with my nitrate? <laughs> So it's funny because you've got some people who never ever test their pond who barely clean their filters and yet they've never have any problems with their um with their pond and with their fish and they are probably no interest whatsoever into the nitrogen cycle in their pond unfortunately if you're like me and if you're interested live into chemistry and into what's happening exactly in the pond or if you know that you've got a problem you need to have a look at what is going wrong and where you can address it and in the pond you might have some fish you might have some uh, some plants you might have and you've got the food going in i haven't got any problems whatsoever anywhere except the nitrate so to address the problem with the nitrate you can do either do some water changes or you can have some plants which are going to absorb your nitrate or you might work with media in your biological filters so water changes you know how much i clean my filters therefore there's enough water changes going into my pond however my big problem here is that i start with my tap water starts at 20 milligrams per liter uh, so no matter how many water changes i do i'm actually putting in some nitrate plants I do not have plants inside my pond, however, I installed a little bug filter, um, but it's not big enough. The media, uh, this is something I work a lot with, and you, you know that if you follow my previous videos, you know that I'm crazy about working with media. And this is how I can address the problem in my um, nitrogen cycle. We have all watched videos from uh, professionals and experts in the area talking about bacteria colonizing the media. So in brief, you've got two types of bacteria and you most probably heard about it already. You've got the aerobic bacteria and the anaerobic bacteria. So it's very simple to, to, to remember which one is which, okay? I am French, as you know. <laughs> As you can hear with my accent and I can give you a tip to to remember it so aer aerobic bacteria there is the word air in it which means oxygen it means that it's on the outside of this the the media okay because you need some oxygen or you need some friction in order for the bacteria to to live on it okay it lives on the outside aerobic bacteria and that doesn't consume the um or just very slightly consumes the nitrate okay so a moving bed with plastic media there is a lot of air okay it's constantly it's like a chaotic environment and that is creating a lot of aerobic bacteria which don't eat the nitrate anaerobic bacteria lives inside the the your your media so nothing can live inside a plastic okay so the moving bed help with your nitrite and this is why i've got it and this is probably why i've got zero nitrite coming back to the anaerobic bacteria that lives inside your ceramic um, your ceramic media i need to look seriously into changing the uh, the multi-bay and how it works okay because it's, it's in the multi-bay that I've got the most media and this is where I'm going to be able to tackle my nitrite nitrate problem sorry I've already done what I needed to do in my shower 
Okay, if you remember my video, and I will po post um, a link in the, in the description about when I changed the media in my shower the, um, during the summer. Um, so have a look at that video. So nitrate problem is going to have to be addressed via a change of media within my filtration system. So there are two elements in my nitrate problem. The first one is there is something not happening within my filtration system, which allows the bacteria to eat the nitrate. So something is not right there. And this is what I'm going to address right now with the help of media, ceramic media. And for this, I just want to thank Mountain Tree for sending me some media for me to work with. As you all know, I'm a big fan of Mountain Tree. And this time they have sent me, kindly sent me some, some media. And I'm buying the media from Filter Pro as well, which is owned by Richard from the Pond Guru. So those are two, my two favorite media, ceramic media. The second thing is removing the nitrate from the tap water that goes back into my pond uh, when I do a, field, uh, a water change. And for that, I will be doing a video next week uh, as I've bought something to be able to do that. So you're probably wondering why I'm obsessing so much with this nitrate, which is not a very high level. And at that level, I don't think it's uh, very toxic for the fish. But if I'm spending so much money uh, in my koi, in my filtration system, in the water that I'm putting in, in electric, I might as well have a perfect quality, water quality. And the presence of nitrate is part of that quality issue, water quality issue. A high level of nitrate can slightly affect your koi. It can affect their skin. It can affect. Uh, it can bring some pink to to their skin. It can make them lethargic. Uh, you can have problem with the blanket weed and al algae or algae, or however you say that. Uh, it can affect the growth of your fish. Um, so there's many elements of nitrate, um, and this is the reason why I need to tackle the nitrate that is first not recycling uh, in, in my pond because of uh, lack of correct media but also I need to tackle that's for a video next week I need to tackle the uh, nitrate problem that is in my tap water so there you go the pump is back on the water is now traveling so let's follow the water <laughs> so vortex now full of brushes it's going to take a lot of hopefully a lot of um, of the debris so traveling from the top here jab mat and underneath packed with um, alpha grog the water goes down on that bay comes back up on this bay here this is packed up with alpha grog again going through a uh, one layer of jab mat traveling above here all the media essential for to work on that anaerobic bacteria so the travel the water travels down and comes back up on this um, on this lotus root and then goes out to the pond so the main difference now is that those two bay are going to work in a slightly different way okay this is to increase my anaerobic bacteria which is going to hopefully now eat my nitrate those two bay here, I want no oxygen. Deprivation, deprivation of oxygen means that the, the, the anaerobic bacteria is going to be living inside the media, doesn't need oxygen. Therefore, no oxygen in those two bays now. This um, bed is just plastic, so this is only aerobic bacteria. There's no anaerobic bacteria in there. Just aerobic bacteria okay and this is going to eat the ammonia and nitrite which is already doing a fantastic job um, uh, as I've got zero ammonia zero nitrite so that's it that's me done the media is uh, installed and hopefully it's going to do their work pretty quick to tackle the nitrate that is within the pond next week I will show you what I'm doing to tackle the nitrite nitrate 
to that is going back into the pond so from my tap water back into the pond when I do water changes and that will hopefully uh, eliminate all the problems that um, my water has got so as I said before there are some people who never have to have all that never because they don't have nitrate nitrite even ammonia problems and they they've got simple filter system so hopefully this is going to make my water very healthy water and beneficial these little guys before i close this video for this week i've got a uh, quite an important message for you guys out there um martin from uh, koi water plant and runs yesterday has released a video where he talks about a project that is very dear uh, to him uh, very important to him and um, obviously the normal crew plus some of the core youtubers are fully backing him up on this one uh, the idea is to build a pond which will be called the charity pond um, and Martin explained on his video where things are at at the moment and how we're going to proceed so there's no money involved we're not asking you to provide it, to give any money uh, nothing like it but it's just an idea that he's put forward and I would really 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 appreciate if you could go and watch his video I'll put a link uh, below in the description and on that note I'll catch you on the next one thanks for watching